go buy you that toy. <laughs> you did. And I always, sorry, Mom, I broke Dusty's flames. Sorry, Mom. Oh, you broke Dusty's propeller. And then what'd you do with it so Luke wouldn't wouldn't find it and try to eat it? What'd you do with it? I just threw it in the trash. You threw it in the trash. Yep. Look at how blonde your hair looks right here. <laughs> Hi. Hi. What are you doing over there? Hey, Jack, do you go to school? Yeah. And what do you like to do in school? Um, Quack some eggs. You like this is going on hour two that I've been home alone, completely alone. The house has been so still and so quiet. I'm loving this. John took Jack to swim class this morning with Luke and he also took my father-in-law and they've been gone since I think 10 o'clock and it's almost noon now. And they're gonna go get some lunch and bring it back. But I am just stoked right now. I have also so funny and true that I love when the house is quiet and I get alone time. I love it, but then it gets a little bit too quiet, if you know what I mean. And I start to miss the kids and I miss John. And so it just goes to show you that um, sometimes I, I want to be alone and I need my space and I think I'm going to go crazy if I don't get my space and my free time and off the clock, so to speak. Um, but then it's, it's too lonely and it's too quiet and I start missing all the craziness. By the way, am I the only one that thinks it's so sweet when your house is quiet and your kids are gone? It's just so sweet to see the little remnants of their play scattered throughout the house and little toys on the floor and like messes that they've made, which totally annoys you, um, or at least it totally annoys me throughout the day. But then when it's quiet and I get lonely, it just makes me happy to see all their little, their baby toys and toddler toys and kid toys around the house. It just reminds me that they're just still so sweet and innocent and little and I just love this stage when they play with the toys. Look, this is what we did this morning. This is their playroom aftermath. And I don't know, it's just really cute. Cause I know so I'm just sitting here with Jack and every so often he says something really funny, like a funny memory, and then I'll laugh totally <laughs> naturally and he gets such a kick out of me watch, laughing watch, at his joke. Watch, watch, watch. That he just keeps watch. saying it over and over watch, and over watch. again on repeat. No, puke. <laughs> He's saying, remember when I puked, right? Yeah. We were looking at a house online that looked like that looked like a house we stayed in over Thanksgiving, and he got sick, and he did what? Just puked. He puked everywhere. And ever since he saw that house, he's been saying, hey, Mom, remember when I puked? Are you ready for your nap? Nope. Daddy's ready <laughs> for Daddy's nap. Daddy's ready for his nap. Do you want to join him? <laughs> yeah. Would that be fun? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Get up. Yeah. How was swim class today, Jack? Can you tell no, no. <laughs> Here's Luke's outfit of the day. It's so cute. Wait, 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 I thought I'd wait, show wait. you guys his wait, outfit. Wait, Luke, model your shirt. Look out, John, with yours. There's Jack. It's like a creamsicle t shirt from Peak. It says, Happy Days. For a happy baby, and, right, Luke? And, and, and these turquoise skinny jeans from Zutano. Look how cute and, this is. And this, and oh. He's Johnny not in the best, but he just woke up from a nap. And Jolly Wrench and Dusty Bloggy. You want to show the camera your Jolly Wrench is dusty? So, yeah, isn't his outfit so cute? Look, he just woke up from a nap, so he's a little bit grumpy. And just, Hi! And, and just, and just <laughs> Dusty from in the movie plays. I love dressing him. <laughs> He's like a living doll. Are you a living doll? Careful. Are you a living doll? Do you want to stand up for us so we can see how tall you are? Uh, he may throw a fit. Let's see. <gasps> wow! Look at you! Look at you! <laughs> Not so sure about that? <laughs> Jack's outfit of the day, because he wanted to be included, is a Hurley t-shirt with a skull on it, because he's super cool. These are some corduroy pants, which is kind of inappropriate, and because my, and it's this 100 seat. degrees outside, and some Crocs. 
Do your little modeling pose for us. Can you model? Yeah. Model. Like this, Jack. And I like this guy for me on my birthday. For your birthday. Go like this, Jack. Model. Model. <laughs> Say, I'm a model. I'm a model. Pose with your hand on your hip like this. <laughs> What's he doing? Number six is our horse. Come on, number six. Ah, that's my horse. Ah! Number six. That's my horse. Ah, no. Don't, don't, my horse. Don't, touch, don't, touch, don't touch the TV. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is your horse winning? Oh, like? <laughs> Pops' is horse is number 16. Yeah. Jack, Pops is number 16. This Pops, this Pops is doing. Is that Pops' horse? Yeah. Here we go. Are they gonna win? Yeah. The first. Oh no! Holy cow! Here comes California Chrome. Oh, oh no! Here they come down the stretch. My horse! My horse! That's my horse! California Chrome! California Chrome! Long shot! What happened? Our long shot came in second. My horse! Oh, no! 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 Then we got the money. What'd you win? How much money did we win? Uh, probably hundred dollars. Yep, we're going to Sizzler. <laughs> we're going to Sizzler tonight, guys. We just won a hundred bucks. Oops, fall down. Oh, it's a big walk. Say, Dada. Come on, uh, guys. Want to come and see walks with me? Okay, I'm just making Jack some dinner, a hodgepodge of things. <laughs> Is that your reaction to when I told you I was cooking with olive oil? I'm gonna cook with some olive oil. Yeah. Is that fancy? Yeah. Let's see, let's see. What are you eating now? That's yeah, your little appetizer. Oh, you got some strawberries, carrots, and applesauce. That's, that's different. So yeah. That's one donut. Oh yeah, he's eyeing. This is a donut. This is a crowbar that Aunt Shada was kind enough to buy us yesterday, and I forgot about it. So I put it in my fridge. I just reheated it in the oven. And this is San Diego's version of the cronut, which is I think it was invented in New York City. It's a hybrid croissant and donut. And I've been saving this since yesterday. I'm so excited to eat it. Look at that. I took one bite. Look at the layers. Oh, wow. Look at this close-up shot. Ooh, this is just like, just like it. So yeah, I'm going to have that later on. But